guys i am so excited isn't it weird how 2023 is literally three days away and christmas was three days ago is that cool or am i just like Never mind. Anyway, guys, I am excited to tell you guys about what I got for Christmas. I know I seem like really animated right now, but that's because it is almost 12 a.m. and I just had two cups of coffee. Not back to back. One this morning, and then I had one today at Dunkin' Donuts because it was actually free. I don't think I'm necessarily addicted to coffee. Since it's been like the holidays and stuff, I've been drinking hot chocolate. I think it's just the idea of having something nice and warm because I also really love tea. I'm obsessed with tea. It's just really good. I don't really know why. Anyway, um, in this video, I'm going to be showing you guys what I got for Christmas. But first, I want to tell you guys about my Christmas. Even without like all the gifts and stuff, it was just so great to be around family. I went to my aunt's house for Christmas and it was literally insane. Not only did we have like a Christmas brunch with like chicken and waffles, she literally had a hot chocolate bar. That is literally something straight off of Pinterest. I was like so confused when I saw the table and I was like, are you sure I'm not? in a hallmark movie christmas was literally so much fun and i was honestly scared i don't know why it's just the fact that like the whole week before christmas i did like so much shopping non-stop shopping i was gonna do a last minute christmas shop with me but i never got the chance to just because of how hectic it was i was honestly even gonna do like a christmas wrap with me video i just ended up going live instead i was literally on live for two hours straight and i only wrapped one thing so the next day on the way to my aunt's house i literally had to sit there and wrap the rest of my gifts in the car and i don't know how i pulled that off i did not think they were gonna come out but they came out and my family was happy and literally that's all that matters it's like happiness and like yeah i don't even know where to start like like at all number one the bags were a gift itself like seriously they're beautiful not only was my aunt's house nice her packaging was beautiful I posted it on my story and people were commenting like wow that's nice i'm just kidding no one said that but i feel like that's what they were saying in their head i mean if they weren't saying it they should have been saying it anyway my aunt got these nice bags not only is it like a gift to my eyesight it's literally a gift for next year the little thing we do in my family is reuse gift bags from the last year especially because inflation gift bags are not cheap i'm just gonna take off the label that says two deja and i'm just gonna re-gift this bag next year so i won't have to spend so much money on gift bags because this year i spent more than 15 dollars on all my gift wrapping supplies and that literally could have gone to i don't know a gift for someone else 15 dollars is not cheap anyway starting with number one i am just as shocked as you are probably about to be i don't know you might not be shocked but i'm shocked like i'll be shocked for you when i tell you i got an iphone 13 for christmas i just don't know what i did to deserve this like just look at it it's just so beautiful and like the packaging is like so nice my reaction was like winning an oscar i can talk about this for two hours let me know in the comments if you want to hear more about my iphone 13 because i know i do want to tell you guys about it i might even like do like an unboxing i've never done one of those before you know how you see people do like the iphone unboxings and they show themselves setting it up so yeah next is the coach bag i got my brain is literally still processing christmas because my bougie aunt got me a coach bag and an iphone 13 so like my brain is all combobulated i got a gap hoodie and not only did i just get like the hoodie i literally got the matching sweatpants like i feel so bougie i feel like one of those rich kids who go to like a disney cruise like on their vacation or something i don't know my cousin got me a nintendo switch travel case which is actually funny because I literally got him the exact same one, except it was like a Black Panther edition. So it had like Black Panther right here. He also got me a Nintendo Switch screen protector and Apple Watch bands. I actually have on one right now. My other aunt, who's actually a teacher, she literally got me these Black Panther Adidas crossover shoe things. I don't even know what to call them. Just look at this. Look at these. These are literally so cool. The detail on them is literally crazy. Like, it just blew my mind. And not only that, but when I opened the box, I had a $10 Chick-fil-A gift card. So that was really cool too. I have more. I'm going to show you a few more things because I am so excited. I just, I want to tell someone, you know? And the thing is, I can't tell anyone in my family because they were all there. So I want to tell somebody else, you know what I'm saying? So I got to tell you guys because I have no friends. So like, you guys i can tell you i'm just grateful i know i keep saying that it feels like a script but i'm seriously grateful i wish i could show you guys like like from like through the screen i, I don't know how i can do that 
I hope my facial expressions are helping. My mom got me this Clinique skincare set. It came with this Moisture Surge Overnight Mask, a Moisture Surge Face Spray for like dry skin, which I can't wait to try because even though my skin isn't like super dry, I wash my face multiple times a day. And last but not least, it came with this Moisturizer Surge hydrator i'm not really sure what that is but i'm assuming that's like a gel or some sort of cream my mom also got me a fire stick tv which is literally insane because i just set up my tv stand and i was asking for one for a long time not necessarily asking for one but just mentioning it and when my mom asked me what i wanted for christmas i didn't know what to say it made me know like my mom was like listening my mom also got me a kindle and kylie watch set it came with a bracelet and a watch i've never had a watch before this is really cool i wore the bracelet today so i don't actually have it with me right now because i took it off earlier so I need to go find it. I think I know where it is, but just to make sure, I gotta go look for it. Be prepared to be jealous. I mean, if you're not jealous, that's fine too. But I know you are jealous deep inside, even if you don't want to admit it. I got Japanese ramen noodles. I mean, I've been singing Mariah Carey all year with my own lyrics. All I want for Christmas is food. And I got food straight from Japan. The back, I can't even read it because it's in Japanese. Oh, actually, there's some English on here too. But still... That is just insane. It is so cool. The funny thing is, I thought I was having real ramen noodles when I went to the store and on the back of the packet, it said it couldn't be microwave and it had to be boiled. I thought that was something. I am so excited to try them. And this time I'm actually gonna know what I'm doing because I also got a ramen for beginners book with 150 recipes on how to cook ramen. I've been reading it and it's so cool. It tells you what you need, how many calories it will be, and like the whole entire prep time and everything. I really can't wait to show you guys. Hopefully that will be in a future video in this upcoming year in 2023, which I'm so excited for. Let me know in the comments what videos you would like to see. I am so excited for 2023. I just can't wait. It's right around the corner and I feel like this year is going to be a great year. Oh, and before you guys go, I also got chopsticks. I went on a whole rant the other day to my mom because I ordered Chinese food and they did not give me chopsticks. You shouldn't have to ask for chopsticks at a Chinese restaurant. I got a fork and a spoon. I was so disappointed when I saw a plastic fork and spoon in my bag. I wanted chopsticks. I mean, I'm happy that I no longer have to hoard those chopsticks that I get from Chinese restaurants. I have my own. Look at that. Anyway, that's it for this video. I have to go to bed because I think my mom's mad at me. But I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please comment what videos you would like to see in 2023. I just want to know. I don't know. Um, but yeah, thank you so much for watching. And I hope you enjoyed this video from the bottom of my heart. Aww.